Hey everyone and welcome back, it's Moonbow here bringing you guys episode 13 part 3 of Suggested Creations in Scrap Mechanic. In this episode, I have finally made the SR-71 Blackbird. Uh, this was requested many times, uh, so I don't even know who to thank. Uh, you guys are awesome, though, for all your suggestions. Uh, so I really hope you guys enjoy this one. Uh, it took a little bit of time and a little bit of uh, touching it up here and there uh, to get it uh, the way I wanted it to, especially with the flying. Um, but in the end, I think I've got the flying down now for most creations, so it's uh, becoming easier and easier and more and more stable every time. Uh, so be sure, guys, to check this one out on the Steam Workshop for Scrap Mechanic. Uh, it'll be available there with all of my other builds. Um, so I hope you guys enjoy this one. I'll uh, show you guys just a few of the uh, key buttons, and then we'll be taking it for a nice little flight. Alright, so to get inside, all you really need to do is just walk here in front of the front landing gear and you can very easily see the two seats right there, um, so you can just hop right in like that. Um, and you press 1 and that'll open up the uh, top of course to get out. Uh, and I'll show you something else very quickly. Um, and this was kind of important actually, I thought of this after and um, it's... It's very obvious that the FPS changes um, the ability to fly in Scrap Mechanic. And so with um, this build here, you pretty much have access to most of the thrusters. You might have to remove some of these down here. Uh, so with them on the workshop, you know, they're very easy to get. So you can get this and hopefully it works in your world. But if not, you can always hop inside here with this chair and uh, tweak the thrusters, you know. Uh, if you just look at the connection tool and follow them to the numbers, uh, you'll get an idea of where you need to maybe increase some power, and uh, maybe it'll fly for you. So aside from one there, um, I've done it before on a vehicle where W is your reverse, so that's what this is here, so that's the only thing that you really need to know for W or S is reverse, and so three is your forward thrust. Uh, two is your upward thrust, as you can see, nice and slight, nothing too fast. And I can show you on the ground here, four is the left roll, five is the right roll, six, six brings your tail down, seven brings your tail up, as you can kind of see, I'm wiggling it there. And if I hover in the ground very quickly, I'll show you guys here the landing gear. I tried to hide it as best I could, um, but, you know, the game is kind of bulky with these blocks, so I tried my best. I'm really happy with it, though. You can barely see it, um, aside from the fact that you can see his head sticking out. But, that's okay. So I hope you guys are uh, gonna enjoy this one. Uh, I had so much fun making this one, actually, and I'm gonna go for a little bit of a flight here in a moment, guys, and I'm gonna show you just how well this plane flies. Like I was saying earlier, um, I'm getting better and better at making them, and now I'm at the point where they're so stable, especially this one though, that's what I was saying though, this one is so good. It's just, it's so well balanced. And the shape that was pretty much given to me as far as like designing this, um, it really allowed for me to make very even thruster spacing. Um, actually, I'll show you guys quickly. The thruster spacing is so spread out here, you can see it's nice and wide, uh, so that just gives me a nice foundation to build on. So this one's very easy to fly, guys. I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, I'm going to go for a bit of a flight, uh, so I will see you guys very soon in the next episode. 